Hello, I'm Amelie and welcome once again to my channel. Today I'm going to be watching episode 5 of The Untamed. First, let's remember what happened in episode 4 because I'm recording this very late at night and my brain decided to stop working around two hours ago, so I need some refreshing to do. So as far as I remember, Wei Wuxian spent pretty much the whole episode being a bisexual disaster. Uh, he got thrown out of the classroom. Not only that, but the grandmaster threw a couple of things at him. I don't know what, but that was definitely something that happened. Uh, let's see. Then he went fishing with my favorite fanboy, Mi Wasan. I love that boy. Uh, then he did a little bit of archery with my other absolutely favorite baby wedding. Um... What else did he do? What else happened that episode? I'm just remembering that. Um, well, yeah, we have the plot. We have the Wen clan coming and, you know, looking to do some mischief. They left uh, Wen Ying and uh, his sister, I think it's pronounced Wen Ching. I'm, I'm not sure. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, so there was also some you know, plot elements in the episode, but I'm pretty much remembering everything else. Uh, Lang Shishen got himself a friend, let's say, uh, in uh, Menyao. I don't know if we are going... I mean, he left, so I don't know if he's going to be in this episode, but I'm I'm pretty confident that he's going to appear again. I'm, it would be very weird if just one character appeared once just to look at Lang Shishen like... Pretty much everyone should look at him. I'm surprised he's the only character looking at him like that. Uh, I'll be right there with Menyao. Uh, what about Lang Shan? What was he doing in this cha in this episode? I'm pretty sure he was just, you know, trying to repress his gayness for Wei Wuxian pretty much all the time, like clenching his sword, just looking at him. And also Wei Wuxian was very annoying in, in that episode, so I can understand him. Um... I think that's pretty much all that happened. At the end, I think uh, Lang Shan was going to look for Wei Wuxian because he was supposed to punish him because of whatever happened in the classroom. Uh, I think that's it. Uh, so I guess we are going to see that punishment now. And you know about the Lang Clan. In only five episodes, I can say that they really love discipline. So I'm, I'm guessing that Lang Shan is going to enjoy punishing Wei Wuxian. Uh, okay, so that that was my summary of episode four. Uh, maybe other things happened and I was just not paying attention to them. So we're just going to start with episode five right, uh, right away. We are watching on Netflix again. I'm skipping the intro and we are starting, let's see, in three, two, one and go. Oh, I'm learning Chinese in Duolingo. No, I'm skipping the recap. I'm skipping the recap too. I'm not watching the recap. Um, I'm watching, I'm learning Chinese in Duolingo and I already know the numbers. And I already saw number five and got excited. <laughs> like, I recognize that number. I love Lang Wenxi's blank face. Like, that, he has like, a, what do they call it? Like, a resting beach face? I love it. Yeah, that was all a lie. Oh, he's just dragging him. We're just dragging people around here. Okay, so Wei Wuxian had to copy lines. I think he had to copy lines like a thousand times. I don't remember how many, but a long time. Oh, that, was, that is a very nice place. Look how perfect Lang Shan looks there. This must be killing Wei Wuxian. Must be so boring. Yeah. <laughs> that song. Yeah, why don't you stare at him a little bit more? I mean, I know that he's trying to, you know, uh, annoy him or something, but yeah, there, there's something behind there, I guess. I really like this song. Did he finish already? 
No, he's just, you know, taking a break to stare at Lang, at Lang Shan. What, what is he going to do? He looks like he's going to do something. Oh, that's so perfect. I haven't practiced doing that yet. Like, no, well, not, not with a, not with a brush or anything like that, but I, I can't do the symbols yet. Just ignoring him. Oh, that caught his attention. <laughs> what? You, you want him to look at you now? Not like. I mean, this flirting that is happening. <laughs> well, at least on, on where we should. No, I don't think that was an invitation to sit closer. I don't think. Why does he hate it? Uh, because he he's a rule breaker, I guess, because of that. I don't think that is a sincere apology. Yeah, in front of you. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I, everybody knows what you're thinking. I guess that's fair. But he also tried to run when he stopped him. And also, I don't think uh, at that point Langshan knew that, I mean, I guess he, well, yes, he knew because he had been introduced. <laughs> I, yeah, well, yes, you see, you can see it wasn't, it wasn't sincere. That, oh my God, what did I just, <sighs> he's going to kill you. He has such a nice smile. Oh, silencing spell. <laughs> I mean, he has to know that it's a possibility that if he annoys Lang Chan enough, he's going to shut him up. Oh, that is my baby. Oh, look at that face. She's looking for something. Whatever that is. It's a nice place here, I say. Oh, that's a nice teapot. Oh, he's so sweet. Does he have like a manicure? I still don't know what they're looking for. They say like the yin iron, but I don't know. As far as I can tell, they haven't said what it is yet. What's wrong with him? No, my baby. Is he sick? So what I'm what I'm getting about this conversation is that they are not necessarily like they don't want to be involved in whatever their clan is involved, like the Wens. He looks so beautiful. What is he doing? Whenever Wei Wishan is smiling, I he he's doing something that he's not supposed to. Yeah, 
Is he drawing him? Did he do a drawing of Lancan? I can't blame him. He looked really beautiful there. Oh, I think he did a, a drawing. Is he going to give it to him? Oh, not even looking. Did he finish already? Has some several days happened or this is the only day? Because he had to transcribe a lot. I can tell that Langshan wants to look, but he doesn't want to give him the satisfaction. Like, okay, I'll look. That's pretty good. I mean, it looks a little bit more like Lang Shi Shen for some reason, but that is a very good drawing. Okay, that was something. Oh, what did he do? Oh my god, what was that? <laughs> Was that what I think what it was? Why are you exposing Langshan to that? <laughs> I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Yes, that was shameless. <laughs> I think Langshan is going to have a coronary. Please, somebody call the ambulance. Yeah, I think. Oh, did he destroy everything? Yes, he destroyed everything. Like, how dare you? <laughs> that little piece that he got. What? <laughs> did he say piss off or did he say something that was a little bit stronger because piss off doesn't seem that strong oh poor, poor Langshan <laughs> well you never heard it, it I mean only where we shan heard it it was only for his ears. <laughs> He's so proud of it. <laughs> yeah, you weren't sincere. I have to say, I think Chang Chang has the best sword. Like, I love that color. I mean, I love purple, so I love that color per uh, combination. It has like a little snake going through it. I love it. <laughs> Why am I not surprised that he's the one who had them? <laughs> I really like this too like the character dynamic of like the sibling relation between these two and it's very difficult to you know um, you know see them now and know what happens after 16 years or what's going to happen eventually What's that? What were they were I was talking about I guess they saw something. Oh, what was that? An owl? That didn't sound like an owl. Well, what do I know what an owl sounds like? That makes sense if they are trying to find whatever they are trying to find.
auditors. I'm just, I'm just going to ignore some of the vocabulary choices happening here. Oh, that, that it was. I, he was on his mind. He's so handsome. I mean, obviously Langshan also, but Langshan is more like he has like a little bit like a baby face, which I I, I find endearing. He's very handsome, but. Like, Shishen is on another level. I read one of the comments that says, like, he was, like, number one of all the men in this. So, I, I understand it. Water goes. I don't like the sound of that. Is this what is this what is this man because they put the name on it, so I guess he's a character, but is he from the Lang clan? Like because he's not wearing the headband. Oh, a little excursion. Oh, that's not her sister. Sister. Why does Shang Cheng look so excited? What's happening here? Well, you didn't say hello to her like formally. I really like Chen Li. I hope this isn't like a sign that she's sick or something. Like, yes, I know that she eventually dies because they said it in the second episode, but... Oh, he's... <laughs> what a little shit she is. Oh, and she's thinking of her own baby. I'm really starting to like this um, Lady Wen. Let's call it Lady Wen because I'm still not sure how to pronounce her name. So would they have like a few free days? Oh, are they going to join him? Because I would love to see like a little excursion with all of them. What are exactly water ghosts? I guess I'll find out. <laughs> oh, these, now these all three... Are going? Oh yes, please let them go with you. <laughs> Is it against the rules? It's just like no. No. <laughs> I like this barrier that when she's creating. Oh, so yes, that was a definitely yes. Oh, he's less sure about her. I think they they are suspicious of her. Now, who else? Who else is coming? 
Oh, is that my baby? It is my baby. And he has a sword and everything. Oh, that is a cool sword. Does her sister have a sword? I didn't see it. I think so. What a world to see that people go to see ghosts. Well, I guess in our world, also people want to see ghosts. They go to like haunted, haunted houses, houses or things like that. But I, I wouldn't be as willing to go. I, I, in this world, I will definitely not be a cultivator. I can say that. Oh, that's adorable. I bet it's going to be dangerous. Who else? Who else is going to join us? <laughs> Let's go everyone. Let's do like a whole group uh, outing. Yes, I mean, you're already here, so let's go. Oh, they're so happy. <laughs> I would say that he wanted one particular boy to go. I love, I love Lang Chishen. He's definitely doing his absolute best to get his brother laid. And that is a good older brother. He's doing his job well. That is the, the bridge of Word of Honor. For those who are watching Word of Honor with me, I get this is not a spoiler. <laughs> I mean, unless the presence of a, of a bridge is going to be a spoiler for you, I'm pretty sure that's the same bridge from Word of Honor. Are they together in the same room? What's happening? Is it dirty? Oh, I guess it's dusty. Don't they clean? Well, I, I, that's a reason enough not to clean the rooms. How much time has it happened between this and the beginning of the conference? Because for what I've seen, it seems like it's like three, four days. So it makes no sense because three, four days they were all there in this, in the same inn with the same man. So I guess some time must have uh, happened between then and now. Oh. How can you see what is in them? Okay, so definitely bad news here. I'm just noticing that in um, Langshan's clothes, there is like a cloud pattern. That's very nice. Why was he looking at the bed? There is not only one bed. There is at least two. I think, I think these are two beds, right? Yes. Well said. <laughs> I still don't understand what they're, these two are doing together in this room. Like, why isn't he with uh, Shang Chen and <laughs> and why is Lang Wenxi not with his brother? Like, what's happening? Why was one room just reserved for them? Why do they need... Why... How long is it going to take that they need a room? Just meditating. Oh, they were going at night. I guess that's prime time for ghosts. Oh, no, they're not going. This is just a, a random person fishing. I guess this person is not going to last long. Like, even in a place without water ghosts, I wouldn't go, like... Oh, oh, 
I don't know what that was, but I didn't like it. I guess it was, there was a full moon, so there was a lot of light. Oh, so this is the next day. So Langshan and Wei Wushan stay, stay in the same room together during the night. Is this what I'm getting? What does he have there? I love how knowledgeable uh, Wei Wishan is. Aren't they? Hmm. <laughs> Just shut up. <laughs> Is that alcohol? He's not going to drink alcohol. I mean, I like that he's he's annoyed with Wibisham, but he's still willing to, you know, talk to him. Oh, what's he going to... <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Is that a true rule? I have the feeling that Lang Chan is just, just starting to invent rules just to annoy Wei Wuxian. Oh, those move by themselves. Nobody, nobody's rowing them. I guess that is like a cultivator power. Just, I don't like that mist. There's something creepy going on here. What that is an interesting distribution in, in the boats. What does a, a go a water ghost looks like? It looks like exactly. Would we see one? I hope not. Yeah, you don't have to say <laughs> not necessary. Oh, what is what is that? What's happening there? So how are they going to like bring them out? <laughs> What's happening? What is he going to do? What was... Oh, no! I don't, what is that? I mean, I guess it looks like a bunch of seaweed. I was expecting something more horrifying, but it wasn't too bad. I mean, it surprised me. Oh, I guess so that is not a water ghost then. He loves to show off. I mean, he's very smart, so he deserved, but... I mean, that is very smart. I'll, I'll give it to him. He's knowledgeable. Oh, <laughs> that's adorable. Ooh. Yeah, he doesn't care. Oh, that's so adorable. Stop flirting during this night hunt.
What? What is he? Oh, okay. I had a heart attack for a moment. Okay. Again, I think in five episodes I've seen uh, Langshan's expression change only once. But I'm not complaining because I like this uh, this face that he has. Oh! Oh! Again, it just looks like seaweed, so I don't know why it's so disgusting. Oh, did it have a face? No, I, I hope it didn't have a face. I really don't want to see that with a face. What does it mean? Oh, I think I get it, but... So, the name of the sword means, and maybe this is a problem with the subtitles, I already said that the subtitles in Netflix are trash. Uh, so, the sword is called, like, whatever you want or something like that. Is that a translation? Oh, what's happening? Oh. oh, is there more than one now? What happened? Oh, did he? What, what happened to him? Did they beat him? Oh, she just appeared. How <laughs> did. I mean, I know she jumped, but <laughs> it was very smooth. Yes, thank you. Thank you for noticing. Oh, I'm fine. Don't be an idiot. There is a, a thing happening here with these two characters, right? Am I imagining this? Oh, what is that? Is he okay? Great job. Oh, these bastards here again. Oh. Good move. Oh, here we are all together. Well, where is Wenin? Somebody go rescue Wenin. I don't want anything to happen to my favorite baby. Oh, those are a shit ton of whatever those are. I think we, we agreed. Well, we agreed. I don't have anything to do with that. They say they are not actually water ghosts. So what are they? What's happening? They are coming together. They are organizing. They are unionizing. Oh, that doesn't sound good. An aqua demon. What are they going to do? <laughs> I mean, yeah. Oh, okay. So we're just flying. What are you doing? That's lost. That you lost a sword. We're just all flying and leaving this one here. Mm. 
why can't uh what's wrong with these two that they don't fly? Oh, he's going to do he's going to do a performance. Let's see if it's well received by the Aqua Demon. Oh, he can fly. And now we are all together. I get oh I guess he cannot fly because he doesn't have a sword because they are Shishen is like standing on his sword so it's the sword that helps them fly. Oh so they are just going to disappear there. Oh what's what's wrong with my baby? We are all we were all very alarmed about this. I guess Lang Shan has to do all the lifting now. That is, he is very strong. Oh, he has such nice hands. That is a very powerful instrument that he has. Pun intended. I don't know if it makes sense in the context, but pun in very much intended. <laughs> oh my god. Not the moment. That's that's nobody. He doesn't touch anybody. Oh, we are not close. I mean, they're. Like, how long have they known each other? Yes, Chang Cheng, please, please have tell Wen Wuxian to have like a sense of the situation in which he's in. I mean, I admire him. Like nothing lets him stop. Uh, let him, stops himself from. Uh, stop him from flirting. Oh, that's the the spy thing. The um, the owl. I guess owl. Is it normal now? Yes, he's normal back. So what's what's wrong with him? What's his problem? Is this part of the like mysterious ailment that he has that his sister cannot cure? Is this any, is there anything in this pot because it looks empty? Yes, there is. There's actually some something in this pot. I can't believe it. Like a soup, I guess. Oh, my poor baby. What is that? He has some experience, I guess. I mean, she knows what's wrong with him, right? Did he? I guess we won't find out. He's so nice. I really like that he's so nice to, to people. That is a nice little pouch. Again, word of honor bridge. Or I guess this bridge. I think I saw it here first. That's a nice comb. Mmm, for who? Is he going to buy a comb? For Lady Wen? I guess he didn't. Or 
maybe he did. We didn't saw him. Imagine being around in town and just seeing this procession. Especially the fur, the, like the two up front, like. Well, I guess maybe because this is close to their home, so I guess they are used to seeing this. Oh, adorable. Winning? Yeah, right. Oh. He admitted it. He was thinking in Wewishan a little bit. That is not an answer. We want an answer. You won't blind us with your beauty. We want an answer. What is he going to do? There is always this little smile that he does wherever she's going to do something. Oh, good catch. No, doesn't like them. There's always this little smile that Wei Shan does whenever he's going to do something to Lang Shan. I love it. Again, good catch. Give some, give one to Wen Ying. Oh, <laughs> I mean, I don't think it was the low quad. Oh, I guess what he's thinking about. Who's that? Was that Langshan? No, that wasn't Langshan because, oh, th that's the end. Uh, it wasn't Langshan because he was with um, Lang Shishen in the boat and this person was alone. So I'm going to guess it's Wei Wushan. Wei Wushan was taking alcohol and guess. And now I'm really looking forward to see what, what happens in episode six. Um, okay, very good. There was a great episode. There was some things related to the plot, I guess. I don't think we got a confirmation, but I think we can assume that they are related to the plot. Uh, but I love to see, you know, uh, Lang Shan and Wei Wushan together. Uh, I love this little excursion of this to fight the Aqua Demon, even though at the, in the end of the, at the end, it was pretty much Lang Shishen who dealt with it. He could have gone alone, I guess, and just dealt with it. But just, you know, he took a whole gang with him. And I, I like that. Um, anything that happened this episode? I, I guess not. <laughs> I guess that was it. I feel like this episodes, and I know they are like, uh, more than half an hour long, but I still, they still feel very short. So I guess that is a good sign that I'm really having fun when I watch it, when I watch them. Uh, I really, really enjoy them. And I, again, uh, I, I'm definitely understanding more and more uh, each that each time. So that helps <laughs> a little bit with the plot. Okay, very good. So that was the end of the Untamed episode five. I guess I'll see you in a couple days with the next episode. Bye-bye.